And here's a look at downtown Minneapolis where the Thunder taking on the T-Wolves. Straight to the fourth quarter, Thunder down five. SGA drives, kicks to Chet Holmgren for a three. Got it, Thunder down just two. After free throws, Thunder back down four. Ten seconds to play. SGA straight to the rack, gets those two points back. He had 32 on the night, by the way. Miss free throw gives the Thunder a chance. Down three, four seconds on the clock. Shea doesn't get it. Thunderfall 106, 103. Steve McGee breaks it all down from Minnesota. OKC okay, looked great in the first half. And uh, Minnesota, if they didn't hit a bunch of threes in the second quarter, this may have been a blowout tonight. But uh, they changed defenses in the second half. Minnesota did. That gave the Thunder some struggles. Oklahoma City only had 17 points in the third quarter. That was a difference maker in this one. And Nas Reed and Troy Brown Jr. come off the bench for the Timberwolves and hit the Thunder for 33 points. Here's Mark Degnall. There was a little bit of slippage in the third uh, after we built a little bit of a lead. We let Edwards uh, get a little loose there uh, and get to some rhythm shots. But for the most part, you know, we gave up 106 points and, and guarded him pretty good. I thought that kept us in the amount of night where our offense really wasn't great, especially in the second half. For the most part, I thought we did pretty well. You know, so their guys stepped up. Some of their guys made some big shots. Troy Bryan had a really tough finish towards the end of the game. So, uh, I mean, their guys played a really good game. And, you know, we kind of let some things slip. Lakers at the Thunder Thursday night at Paycom Center. That's a wrap for Minnesota. More news coming up after the break.